Hi, I'm Pastor Peter from Sweden. I'm standing here outside La Sagrada Familia uh, in Barcelona. And uh, this is a church that is famous for a few things. One is that it was, the construction started in 1882, a long time ago, and it's still not finished. They're still building on it and at the same time renovating the older parts. And another thing that it's famous for is that the chief architect, Anthony Gaudi, kind of gave his life to this project, but was unable to finish it. This is a very interesting image of church, I think. What is a church? What do you think of when you hear the word church? I think many of us think of a building, probably not as grand, as amazing as this one, but something that is built by people from materials such as wood or stone or whatever. But in the Bible, the word church is mostly used to describe people, people who believe in Jesus Christ. And when the apostles are writing to the church in Rome, they're not writing to an address, a specific building with a cross on top of it, but they're writing to a group of people who have heard about Jesus and have come to faith in him. And it's interesting that in 1 Peter, that Peter's first letter, Peter writes about the believers as living stones who together build the church. So in a similar way, to which this grand church behind me is still being completed with new parts, new rocks, hopefully completed in 2026, three years from now. In a similar way, God is still building his church stone by stone with each believer who is baptized into the family of Christ or comes to faith through hearing the word and together we build the church. That's something to think about. And if you feel that you don't really have a place, uh, you don't really know what the purpose is of your life, you can be a living stone in the church of Jesus. Thanks for spending time with me today, and God bless you again. Bye now.